focus now to some important breaking news that is coming in on the broadcast. As far as the Article 370 hearing is concerned in the Supreme Court, oral remarks by the CGI at this point in time, he's gone ahead and said that the Article 35 took away the fundamental rights and violated equality of job opportunity. It also violated the right to acquire immovable property. Harish is joining me to give us details. Harish, what are the oral remarks that have been made by the CGI at this point in time as far as the hearing in the Article 370 in the Supreme Court is concerned? Yes, that's right. Important oral observation from Chief Justice of India, D.Y. Chandrachur, during hearings of quotations challenging abrogation of Article 370 and Article 35A. Uh, he said the enactment of Article 35A, in fact, took away the following uh, fundamental rights of uh, citizens, equality of opportunity for all citizens in matters relating to employment or appointment to any office under the state, right to acquire immovable property, employment under state government. So there was a uh, special right for residents and uh, that take away the right for non-residents. So, uh, very impo important oral observations as far as the government's decision to abrogate the Article 35A is concerned. And let me uh, in the, remember Article 35A allowed Jammu Kashmir Assembly to frame rules defining permanent residents and prohibits non permanent residents from settling permanently in the state and acquiring immovable property, government jobs, or scholarships. Article 35A, remember, had come into being through a presidential order without being passed by the parliament. So, a very significant oral remarks were coming in from the five judge constitution bench as far as government's decision to abrogate Article 35A along with Article 370 is concerned. Back to you. All right, Harish, thank you for bringing us all the observations at this point in time, which is made by the CGI as far as the hearing in the Article 370 in the Supreme Court is concerned.